Hello friends, today we'll learn about what if we dumped our trash into volcanoes? This dustbin is full of garbage. Hmm, what can you use to dump the trash instead of this bin? Uh -huh. You're thinking of transport all the trash to the volcanoes. Well, it sounds great, but it wouldn't be that easy. Let me explain all about this. There are only about 1,500 potentially active volcanoes worldwide, and around 50 to 70 volcanoes erupt each year. Volcanoes spew hot, dangerous gases, ash, lava, and rock that are powerfully destructive. So most people don't want to live right near an active, erupting volcano. It means you have to transport the trash to an active volcano and getting all that trash could turn out to be a time-consuming, expensive, and dangerous endeavor. On a worldwide scale, humans produce about 2.6 trillion pounds of trash per year. A large volcano with broad top is required for all the garbage. Shield volcanoes are truly massive with volumes, but unfortunately, true shield volcanoes are rare and they're considered weak due to their low viscosity. So, the next option is stratovolcanoes. They have relatively steep sides and are more cone-shaped than shield volcanoes. They're formed from viscous, sticky lava that does not flow easily. You can say they're apparently not the safest location for the town dump. Let's find out if it's even a valuable idea to dump it inside. Look here, this is a vent. The location from which lava flows and pyroclastic materials are erupted, and things only get worse once you start throwing stuff inside. In 2002, a group of Ethiopian researchers chucked a 30-kilogram bag of trash into a volcano, and the results were explosive. Lava lakes are often incredibly unstable. If you suddenly pierce the surface, you can trigger an immediate chain reaction of explosions involving high-pressurized and acidic steam, as well as lava blebs and bombs. It's true that lava is hot enough to burn up some of the trash, although lava at 2,000 degrees Fahrenheit can melt many materials in trash, including food scraps, paper, plastics, glass, and some metals. It's not hot enough to melt many other common materials, including steel, nickel, and iron. Also, not all lavas are the high temperature type. Suppose it was possible to dump trash safely into a volcano. What would happen to the trash? When plastics, garbage, and metals burn, they release a lot of toxic gases. Sulfur gases can create acidic fog, also called volcanic fog. It can kill plants and cause breathing problems for people nearby. Not to mention the fact that you'll be burning a bunch of trash and any smoke generated will go straight into the atmosphere, creating a lot of air pollution. So throwing the mass detritus created by human civilization into a volcano isn't an option. Now, you know a lot about the topic, Stay tuned for more videos. Bye-bye.